To be human is to grow. We grow from the moment we are conceived. We take a chance. We give it a shot. We revel in success and learn in failure. We begin as students to become professionals. From children, we become parents. From individuals, we grow into communities. As long as we are alive, the potential for growth is always there. But there are those who have lost their ability to grow. This was the case for the indigenous people of the remote Wayu region, an area between Colombia and Venezuela. Here, the consequences of this industrial age have created such devastation and poverty on their land, it has prevented this matriarchal group from growing. Until now. For the past six years, the Wayu Taya Foundation has committed to helping committed to preserving the traditions of these great indigenous people, their spirits, their ability to hope, to thrive, to grow. Hola, welcome to Wayutaya. I'm so excited to tell you everything that has been accomplished during the past year. One of our biggest accomplishments is new first and second grade school rooms in our Tipishi Talashi school, which means happy kid. Las últimas llaves, la entrega, por fin. <laughs> Another accomplishment this year was the alliance with our technology partner, HP, where together with the University of Sulia, we developed an interactive software for the preservation of the Wayu dialect. At our women's center, Takashimaya, we have anywhere between 80 and 100 women. Well, our new addition this year is that now, every other week, these women are getting seminars on something. Family planning, if it's hygiene, nutrition, and any other related topics. But education must go beyond the basics of reading, writing, and arithmetic. Two initiatives that we started this year that I'm so excited is the arts. Artists from Sulia came to Tepishi Talashi to work with the kids for a day. They work with acrylics, with watercolors, they use their hands, their feet, and they created some amazing pieces. This turned out to be an incredible experience for everybody and an incredible success. The University of Sulia is going to start working on a yearly basis with the kids of the Talashi. Another great event we had was a concert in a great theater in Caracas called Teresa Carreño, where 167 musicians from a very famous orchestra called Orquesta de la Juventud Simón Bolívar performed and 100% of the proceeds went to Wayu Thai. After we did this concert, we thought, wait a minute, kids from indigenous communities are so musical. What if we could bring music to our school? During the 70s, a man named Mr. Abreu started a program in Venezuela called El Sistema, where every kid has access to music. Together, we were able to join forces to start El Sistema at the Talashi. All of this growth, all of these accomplishments, it's because of you because of your generosity, your faith, your trust. On behalf of the Wyatt Taya Foundation team and myself, thank you so much from the bottom of our hearts. Gracias. 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 Gracias.